Hey everybody, welcome back to Big Daddy's Barbecue Pit. This week we're going to show you how we make some homemade pork rinds. Uh, it's a really good snack that we enjoy a lot. You can put all kinds of different flavors on them. You actually, you can just pick these bags up with the pork rinds that are, it's kind of like a, de they call them pork pellets, but it's like a dehydrated pork skin. And we're going to heat these up. We got the oil heated up to 400 degrees. We're going to throw just a probably a half a cup or three quarters of a cup into the oil. We're going to cook these things up and season them how we like them. So we got this oil running at 400. And I'll show you here. I'm only going to stick in a handful. That's how many is going in. So you just want to drop them in the oil and you can pull your basket out, spread them around and put them down in the oil. And you'll watch them, they'll start popping and opening up. Once they fully open, it's only gonna take maybe three, four minutes at tops. They'll be completely cooked, we'll get them out and we'll season them while they're hot. And we'll wait for them to cool a little bit and then we'll give them a try. So we're just pushing it down in the oil, making sure it get cooked real good. We probably could have put a few more in, but you can see how big they're getting. And these things really expand. Uh, and they taste so, so much better fresh than what they do out of a bag. Plus you can control what you're putting on them. We're just gonna dump these guys in there. You hear them crackling, sound like Rice Krispies. We're gonna go ahead and do another batch. I'm gonna go in with a little bit more this time. Spread them out, we'll get them down and we'll put a link in the bio uh, to where you can get these on Amazon. That's where we buy them, like 10 bucks a bag. And you're probably getting, I don't know, probably five, maybe six grocery store bag fulls of these, uh, of the pork rinds when they're cooked. So it's a good deal, 10 bucks, a little bit of oil, you got yourself a snack. Okay, this is our third batch we got done here. We're gonna get these here in our pan that we have lined with just a little bit of paper towel. We're gonna dump these guys in. And what we've learned is you wanna season them really while they're hot. So today we're gonna use Killer Hogs D-Hot Barbecue Rub. I'm gonna get this on. Give it a good sprinkle of this. Give it a little shake. We're gonna let that sit a couple more minutes, let them cool just a little bit. We're gonna give them a try. Okay, we're gonna give these home fried pork rinds a try. We got some Killer Hogs hot sauce we're gonna put on here. Just a few little drops, give it a little extra kick. You hear them things still popping. We're gonna give one of these bad boys a try. Come going in for that big one. Oh, yeah. mm. Nice, crunchy, so fresh. Not out of the bag, you can do them right at home. That killer hog's hot, and that hot sauce takes it to a whole nother level. Do us a favor, make sure you hit that like and subscribe. Leave a comment below, get you some of these. They're not hot at all, Charles. 